Rapino talked with Rachel Maddow on MSNBC about why members of the team have chosen to be so outspoken, both about politics and social issues in America. I think, honestly, a lot of it comes um, just from my gut and from my heart. I'm, I'm quite off the cuff, but I'm also very thoughtful and understand um, and take a lot of pride in, and um, take very seriously the platform that we have. Are we doing enough? Are we good enough? Um, can we be better? And I think the answer to those questions is always yes. So I feel like for me, it's, I feel a responsibility to do this. Like I'm, I'm privileged to be a famous person and to be on this team and to be who I am. And if I just stay silent, it seems awfully selfish. Rapino talked about hearing the chants of equal pay in the stadium after they won that World Cup. The time for women to be paid the same and receive the same benefits as the men's te national team, she says, has arrived. We've proven in sort of every metric um, that we've come up against that um, the conversation needs to move to the next piece. How do we do that together? We need everybody to do it together. We need the Federation. We need FIFA. We need all the confederations around the world and the players to be on the same page because mm -hmm. everybody's input is valuable in moving this conversation forward. As you know, earlier this year, the members of the women's team filed a class action lawsuit against the U.S. Soccer Federation accusing the organization of gender discrimination. The suit claims women make 38% of what the men earn. No word yet on when a ruling will be made.